Once upon a time, there was a loving and caring mother named Sarah. She had three children, and she devoted all of her time and energy to taking care of them. Sarah was always there for her children, no matter what. When they were sick, she stayed up all night to take care of them, and when they had a bad day at school, she listened to them and comforted them. Despite the challenges of raising children, Sarah always managed to keep a positive attitude. She was patient and kind, and she always put her children's needs first. One summer, Sarah decided to take her children on a camping trip. They packed up their tents, sleeping bags, and hiking gear, and set out for the wilderness. The trip was full of adventure and excitement. They hiked through the woods, swam in the lake, and roasted marshmallows by the campfire. And through it all, Sarah was there, making sure her children were safe and happy. One night, as they sat around the campfire, Sarah's children told her how much they loved her and appreciated everything she did for them. They thanked her for being such a wonderful mother, and Sarah couldn't help but feel overwhelmed with love and gratitude. As they packed up their campsite and headed home, Sarah reflected on the trip and realized that being a mother was the most rewarding and fulfilling job she could ever have. She knew that no matter what challenges lay ahead, she would always be there for her children, just as they were always there for her. And so, Sarah continued to be a loving and caring mother, always putting her children's needs before her own, and always being there for them no matter what. Her children grew up to be happy and successful, and they knew that they owed it all to their amazing mother who had given them so much love and support throughout their lives. My mom is the most amazing woman I know. She is strong, kind, and always there for me. I can't imagine my life without her. I remember when I was little, she would always read me stories before bed. She had a way of making the characters and the stories come to life, and I would always fall asleep feeling safe and loved. As I got older, my mom was always there to support me, no matter what. When I was struggling in school, she would help me study. When I was going through a tough time, she would listen to me and offer me advice. She always believed in me, even when I didn't believe in myself. My mom is also a very talented artist. She can paint, draw, and sculpt. She has even won a few awards for her work. I love watching her create art, and I'm always amazed by her talent. But most of all, I love my mom because she is my best friend. We can talk about anything, and I know she will always be there for me. She is the strongest, most loving woman I know, and I am so grateful to have her in my life. When I was 10 years old, I was playing in the park with my friends when I fell and broke my arm. I was in a lot of pain, and I was scared. My friends ran to get my mom, and she came running to the park. She was so calm and collected, even though I was crying and in pain. She took me to the hospital, and she stayed with me the whole time. She held my hand and told me everything was going to be okay. I'm so grateful for my mom's strength and love. She has always been there for me, no matter what. I know that I can always count on her, and that makes me feel so lucky. Once upon a time, in a small town nestled in the heart of the Midwest, there lived a woman named Mary. Mary was a beautiful and kind-hearted woman who spent her days taking care of her three children. She always had a smile on her face and a kind word for everyone she met. From the time her children were born, Mary devoted herself completely to their care. She spent countless hours reading stories, playing games, and snuggling with her little ones. She made sure they ate healthy meals, got plenty of exercise, and always had a clean and comfortable home. 
As the children grew older, Mary's responsibilities only increased. She helped with homework, listened to their worries and fears, and always made time for a long talk or a hug. She worked hard to instill strong values in her children, teaching them to be honest, kind, and respectful. Despite the demands of motherhood, Mary always made time for herself. She enjoyed long walks in the fresh air, reading books, and painting. She found joy in even the smallest moments, and her children loved her all the more for it. One day, tragedy struck. Mary's husband was killed in a terrible accident, leaving her alone to raise their children. It was an impossibly difficult time for Mary, but she somehow managed to keep going. She leaned on her faith, her friends, and her family, and through sheer grit and determination, she kept things together. As the years passed, Mary's children grew up and left home. They went on to lead successful lives, but they always remembered the love and sacrifice their mother had shown them. They would often call or visit, just to hear her voice or share a cup of tea. Eventually, Mary became a grandmother. And she reveled in the joy of watching her grandchildren grow up. She loved nothing more than sharing stories, baking cookies, and teaching them to love the simple pleasures of life. And so, Mary lived a long and happy life, surrounded by the love of her family and friends. She faced many challenges along the way, but through it all, she remained a constant source of strength and comfort to those around her. She was, and always would be, an amazing mother.